here with the wonderfully talented Max Amini. He's played my husband on television, and he's from my hometown. A shout out to Montgomery County, Maryland. That's right. So I am so excited to see you perform. Tell us about how you got involved with all of this. Uh, this is the first Middle Eastern Comedy Festival in Los Angeles. Uh, I know the comedians are putting it together. I was uh, lucky to be a part of it. So tomorrow night, tomorrow's Thursday, uh, yeah. Friday, Friday night, we're doing another section for stand-up comedians, and uh, I'm performing with them. So yeah. Awesome. And how do they find you? Like through the clubs? You're you're a known name in the community. I'm assuming they just found you, right? Yeah, they Googled me. Google, Google Maximinia pops up. Uh, no, I just know the comedians. We're all friends, so everybody knows each other. I've been doing stand-up in LA for eight years, so we cross paths and you go, ha ha, you look like uh, my people, and they go, yes, my people, and we connect. Exactly. So yeah. <laughs> Yes, ha ha is my <laughs> thing. <laughs> I love it. So tell our viewers what you're up to. I know you're in an upcoming feature film. It's directed by an Iranian, right? Yes, uh, it's a feature film called uh, Beer Pong Saved My Life. And I uh, play a guy who sucks at beer pong. So uh, yeah, it's fun. It was a fun movie. Uh, and actually, it's about to be finished next month. So I'm excited for that. We'll see exciting, what happens. Exciting, exciting. So you, but you told me that you do not play an Iranian. You're playing an American guy, right? Yeah, and this one I do. Uh, I play an Ameri I guess, yes. Um, I'm an undercover Iranian in that one, yeah. Oh, but what, like, so what's your character? Just like a, like a beer drinker guy, like a... It's a hippie, a loser, beer drinking, um, out of college, no life kind of guy. Well, like the Pineapple Express, uh, James Franco character. Yes, yes. I love it, Maximini. Awesome. And where else can we catch you around town? I know you, and you're around the country. You're performing back home, right, in, in D.C.? Yes, you can usually catch me around town. Uh, I hang at the Alaf Market on uh, Pico <laughs> Boulevard. You can catch me at all the Persian restaurants at lunchtimes. I love Ruby restaurant. Uh, they give me free muscle khyar. How can I complain? What about Daria? Are you getting the love from Daria and Shiraz restaurant? Yes, I love them too. Harki mi, harki kubi de mi de man That's good. That's awesome. I hope they give you the tadiko. Oh, mi varam tadiko pa shama mi dan. No, tadik ne mi dan. Maybe next time I'm gonna ask for tadik. That's they it. They charge you extra, extra. And uh, I just have. One question. Sure, sure. Could you compare and contrast the one and girls move in the East Coast versus the West Coast? We travel. Okay. Be careful, you're question. standing next to an East Coaster. Okay, the question is what's the difference between Iranian girls on the East Coast and the Iranian girls on the West Coast? They're more uh, blingy on the West. Well, well they're, they're more blingy. Uh, fake, lots of work, fake, you know. Uh, I tell you. The, the <laughs> Should I answer the question? They're all blonde. <laughs> I'm stealing it from I'll you. tell you. No, no, I just think uh, all the Iranian girls are lovely and, oh, and, and phenomenal. So I'm a cop out. <laughs> hey, Matt, why are you so skinny? Did you have a girlfriend who takes care of you? Uh, just oh, Ruse and I, and I lost some weight. That's not. I, I've always been skinny. I, I've always been skinny all my life. So I, that's just it doesn't. Yeah. He's very active. I've run into you. You're, you know, you're moving around. Yeah, I'm moving around and I yeah, lose I weight. I'm just all day I'm moving yeah, around. Yeah, running around from show to show to gig to gig. Yeah, that's that's the that's that's, that's uh, that's it's called the uh, weight loss, running around. That's there we go. Exactly, exactly. Yeah. So, and our viewers can find you on your website, which is maxcomedian.com. Are you on MySpace and Facebook? MySpace, Facebook, you name it. Just Twitter? Google Max. Are you Twitterable? Twitter? You know, I'm on Twitter, but I don't know how to do this thing. I'm not a hang. It's like I'm not. I'm drinking coffee. Like it's just not my thing. I guess I don't know. I'm not used to that one yet. But I'm, um, uh, I guess, okay, if you twit me, you'll, you'll see, you know, okay, I don't know. Like a post from like two weeks ago. Uh, my, the last post I did was back in, back at the green movement time where everything was right on. sensitive. So I was uh, on top of everything then, but now I haven't been on the Twitter thing for a while. But don't be disappointed, Facebook me. Yeah. And also, I want to add, these are very interesting times with what's going on. And also, wasn't it great that Shara Ardashlu won the Emmy and broke the barrier? That is such an exciting time for us, don't you think? It's absolutely inspiring. It's just it's so, so inspiring. Beautiful. It's yeah. absolutely for us Iranian uh, artists. Yes. It's beautiful to see that happen. So uh, it was absolutely amazing. Yeah, definitely. Well, thank you so much, Max. Well, thank you guys. Have a great night, day, everything. All right. Awesome. Peace out.